Hey guys, how you doing? Happy New Year. We're going to do a little tour of the Pez room here, but I've got a question for you. I'm going to be in the Cleveland convention this year, and Rick has asked me to do one of the seminars. And I'm honored to do it, but I don't know what to talk about. So I'm going to do this little tour so you guys get an idea of what's in this collection and what you might want to hear at the Cleveland Pez convention. We'll do a video of it, uh, I assume, so that we can uh, get it here on the YouTube video for everybody. Let's do a quick little tour. Uh, we've got uh, just shy of 5,000 dispensers or so here. Uh, and so let's see, you got your kind of your standard tin, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles with a couple of variations, some rare ones. Um, I'm not sure there's anything exciting up here, maybe except for this painted uh, plaster model of one of the Nintendo characters that didn't make. Of course, you got the two different Pink Panthers, the Crystal Sesame Street. Here's my superhero section. Uh, you got a couple of the... Uh, no web spider man you got dbps in here you've got the hulk with the test writing on the bottom which might be just a big scam who the heck knows you got a whole bunch of different zoros and different size logos some funkos mixed in here the entire well, one of my batgirls is missing in transit but otherwise hong kong and made in hong kong what else is cool in here got this gamma bank and the box um Let's see, down here we've got our Star Wars, uh, Star Trek, and other alien and magic stuff. Here's probably the prize on this shelf is the light blue helmet, Astronaut A, a variety of different color stormtroopers, space troopers, another plaster piece here, a uh, test piece or two in this bunch. Uh, uh, let's see, we've got another test piece here with the red guy, you got the insert ears, uh, the White Eye, Tom, a couple of really hard to find orange and yellow Barneys, Spain stuff throughout. So we could do stuff on stems, we could do variations. I'm not bringing all the hearts, so we'll just get the heck out of here because there's more down there. Still missing some of those. We've got all the FX, all the, um, well, missing the yellow psychedelic flower, but otherwise we've got a pretty nice variety in here. All the Japanese minis finally got those last of the mini mini, not just mini, but mini mini. That was a tough set to get. All the kooky zoos and uh, and circus animals, everything from a really dark blue mimic to the green elephants to the kooky zoo variations. Sold a couple of those recently. The pink elephants, um, yellow hat clown. A couple of these really tough to find USA ponies and USA cows. I still need a, one of these cats up here. Uh, the white cockatoo, a couple of Hong Kong pieces. Is that what that is? Yeah, Hong Kong. Uh, my regulars are undergoing a transition here. If you've been watching some of my videos, you see I'm doing a little exploration of the different regulars. But we've got maybe one of the largest ad regular collections. If not me, there's only a couple more that might uh, rival it. Down here, what's fun? We've got a test stem on Mowgli. You got this fun red beak. Where's my... I got another uh, elephant somewhere. I'm not sure what else is exciting in here. Mary Poppins, dark blue, snow white. More of those guys. We've got, you guys have seen some videos on these guys, Black Santa, Syrup Santa, Made in Germany Santa, there's a yellow Santa in the back there. Um, hmm. We've got our cow bees, a whole variety of kooky zoo lions, your pandas, a Brazil panda, dark blue, definitely video on that. Some plaster stuff they didn't make, this elephant they didn't make. Uh, the owl they didn't really make, this penguin that might be garbage or not, a yellow parrot, There's a whole bunch of different dog whistles. What else is fun in there? There's a lot of fun stuff. Now we're down into the Vushkos, the, the Olympic stuff. We got a few of those, a couple of the Alpines here, Hard Rock, Make a Face. Now this is, a, when the house is on fire, this is the shelf I come to. 
all the die cuts, the Popeyes, the cool blower whistle, make a face, three different lion club, the three asterisk, hippo, crazy fruit, no lemon, one of the few things I'm missing here, depending on how you count. Uh, and we'll just go this way. We've got all the, the pals, quite a few going on. Got the resin admiral, the uh, ringmaster from the commercials, black Maharaja, orange face Yugos, white face Canadians. Um, what are those guys? Uh, Brazilian policeman and doctor, Spanish collection over here with the rest of the guys hiding in the back. Uh, Disney coming down here, uh, continuing on the, the Mary Poppins shelf. We've got a whole bunch of King Louis, Goofies. There's a ton of Spain and USA. Here's the set of six soft heads, uh, Brazilian, um, Pluto, and a ton of other stuff. Uh, some other weird stuff going on in here. Oh, there's one of my guys I moved. Down below, some of the, well, all the Hello Kitties, short of the newest set. Uh, I'm not sure there's anything particularly crazy down there. A whole bunch of variations on some things, but a lot of these are just one-offs. Then, all the space guns. Uh, this was one of my first videos I did. This guy in, uh, in display, bendy arms and legs. More of the space guns. Missing just one or two of those. All the bugs, all the different stem labeling items. Uh, two rows of that. Our soft heads, Hong Kongs and made in Hong Kongs on the Erie Specters. The red antenna ladybug. All the Halloween stuff with a couple of the Funkos mixed in there, including the Witch Regular and the Witch Bee and, uh, and the Universal Monsters and Fishmen. Uh, pink Orange Eye Monster. What else is crazy in here? Um, there's a lot of cool stuff, but nothing crazy out of the ordinary. Let me have a seat down here. We've got a couple of different uh, pet. What's that Charlie Brown doing? I can't remember why he's like that. Maybe he's a double down. I don't know if this is real or not. A little plaster mock-up of Lucy. I think it's not. Uh, pink Cool Cat. Some other stuff. Um, little test pieces over here. Down below, we've got the rest of our cartoony stuff. Um, some minis. A whole bunch of the fattier bunnies, but not as many as I thought I had. A whole bunch of ducks. And now, moving around. Painting from my mom. Got one of the vending machines. Box of Triscuits. Another vending machine. With some of my books on top. And here's where I started to collect Funko and then realized they were going to put me out of space. And I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. Item right back here, we've got the blonde boy. At least one of them, the blue boy. A gold, funky, or whatever his name is, Freddy Funko. Um, you know, there's some there's some neat pieces. Uh, what do we have here? Some of the fake stuff, including uh, an auction I won this Brokeback Mountain Pez, the Metro, the Expert Space, the Compact Penguin. Sold some of these Indians recently, but not selling these. These are painted hair and painted face, two different variations there. Here's a rare test piece made by Pez with a little metal movie film strip projector on top. A whole bunch of footballs, football players. Uh, this test piece, glow in the dark baseball, the baseball mitt, glove, with bat, and the home plate, and the box. Mm, a coin dish or an ashtray. Whole bunch of vending boxes. Oh, we haven't gotten to that part. Uh, let's see, we got a box with some cellos, but I guess what's fun down here, there's a couple of hard to find soccer balls hiding in there. All your all your ball molds, funky faces, emoticons, a couple of those cool guys in the boxes down there, followed by all the varieties of whistles. And we'll keep on coming up over here. Got some boxes, but we've got a whole bunch of trucks. By no means all of them, 
but quite a few. These are all the C trucks um, and the CR trucks. And some stuff that's harder to find over here. These are your Joe's trucks and your Misfit trucks, your D trucks, and then bottom row is all your A trucks. Uh, you got a couple of the, um, or you got the B trucks rather. What, what am I doing? B's and A's and F's and E's. The convention dispensers and more trucks. These fancy little cars. There's cars, more cars down here. A lot of the Barky Brown. I call this the charity shelf. There's some mostly Barky Brown, but some other stuff over here. And I think there's a video on my YouTube page for that. Down here's a lot of the promotional stuff and the Pez guys. So you got Peter Pez and Bubble Boy and the, the Pez candy dispensers, as well as the mystical crystal balls. The Pezasaurs, and then you've got all the stuff that's, you know, released by a government or a band or a magazine or something else. Uh, Glow in the Dark eBay, um, Jack in the Box with the Food Maker patent. Uh, what else? The NH Trio, NH Hotels. What, uh, what do you like? That's Joe, the uh, Pez president, signing that. I don't know. Here's the Be Careful What You Buy. That's not a real Pez vending machine, but this one is. This guy hung out in my office because I was afraid to bring him home for a couple of months. Um, another Gamma Bank, one of my other Mickey uh, auction Swarovski things, although it's not Swarovski. A whole bunch of vending machines, all different here. Got my favorites. This is my staging area where I haven't decided what I want to do with these things, what I want to put away yet. Uh, we were watching Pez Heads the movie and uh, and some more vending machine boxes. One, two, three, four, five, six different varieties up there. Uh, in the cabinets, I've got stuff that uh, I just haven't figured out how to display yet, including costumes and old candies and uh, stuff to sell. This one, real tough. This one's full of the old candies and stuff I need to sell. Uh, I'm not sure there's anything good in here. Eh, yearbooks. And then the closet behind that vending machine over there has got some more stuff stuck in there. So, guys, long video. If you made it to the end, what do you want to do here? What do you want to see in Cleveland? What do you want to hold in your hands? I'm not sure that that's going to happen. What would you like? What do you want to hear about?